Hi everyone. Good morning. Welcome again to my channel, Bing's Life and Prayer. Let us begin. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. My dear friends, today is the first day of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, our Blessed Mother. Let us invoke the Holy Spirit to guide us in our prayer for today. O Holy Spirit, at creation's first dawn, you came forth to give form and life to all. the beginning of this new day. Shape my life today in the image of Christ. Let nothing unlovely be found in me. Rim with your light my life's horizon. Dispel all darkness from my mind and my soul. Light in my heart, the fire of love. Be you yourself, the light I reject today and every day of my life. My friends, let me share with you of what Mama Mary is telling me of her message taken from her blue book, message number 383-370 and 417. And then my mother, the Blessed Virgin Mary, tells me, My daughter being, gathered yourself to a cenacle of prayer, because this is the fifth day in the cenacle of my Immaculate Heart. Today, the Holy Spirit will be upon you. Thank you for uniting me in prayer. The Holy Rosary I tell you, my daughter, pray the Holy Rosary unceasingly. Pray. Pray and pray. I am calling you to continue praying the Holy Rosary to obtain the great gift of the second Pentecost. And learn to read and meditate what is written in the sacred scripture. 
meditate it in silence and it will help you understand what would it means the mysteries of my son Jesus the mysteries given in the holy rosary and in these new times in which you are living you will understand what was happening now in this world it was already written in the gospels and in the letters of the apostles of my son Jesus look my daughter being the signs of the great tribulation was already foretold before all ages that is why it is my urgent call for you to read and meditate the sacred scriptures the holy bible in order for you to understand more and more Never forget to hold the beads and pray to the Father in heaven. Pray unceasingly, my daughter, because I am forming you in your hearts in order to bring you to conversion and to open you to a new capacity for love. Accept the love of my son Jesus faithfully and see how you will be converted deep inside in your heart and everything will follow. This love of my son Jesus will teach you how to be humble, how to be merciful, how to be generous, and how to be prayerful. My daughter, I am forming you in your souls, helping you to cultivate the great gift of divine grace, of purity, and of charity. in my heavenly garden I am bringing you to the blossom of my beautiful flowers of all virtues that you will inherit if you deeply love my son Jesus and you will grow in holiness I am forming you in the light of the Holy Spirit so that your body will be a dwelling place, a living temple of my son, Jesus. Consecrate now to my immaculate heart, and I lead you the way of purity, of beauty, of harmony, of joy and peace. My daughter being, I am preparing you to the new coming of my son Jesus. I am opening the door of my son Jesus in your heart. Allow yourself to be formed and prepared by me, your heavenly mother.
telling you my message today. ever-loving Blessed Mother Thank you so much for your wonderful message to me this morning Thank you, my Mother Hail Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy Heal our life, our sweetness, and our hope To you do we cry, poor banished children of Eve To you do we send up our sigh, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn the most gracious advocate, your eyes of mercy towards us. And after this our exile, she want to ask the blessed fruit of your womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary. Pray for us, O Holy Mary, Mother of God, that we be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by His life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, Grant we beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to your protection, implored your help, and sought your intercession, was left unaided. Inspired with this confidence, I come unto you, O Virgin of Virgins, my mother. To you I come, before you I stand sinful and sorrowful. O Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not my petition, but in your mercy, hear and answer me. Amen. My dearest Mother, I offer my intentions for today. For the safety and protection of my family, especially from this pandemic COVID-19, I also offer the intentions of the Holy Father. Pope Francis to end this pandemic. Please, Mother, intercede for us, your children. Hear our prayers, O oh, Mother. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, holy be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.